Welcome to MusicMoveIt.com. I am Torio, and today I want to talk about promoting your song on social media. I want to thank you so much for joining me today. I really do appreciate it. Now, if you end up liking the video on the end, please hit that like button. It really helps the channel out a lot. Also, if you're not subscribed yet, please consider doing so. I do tons of videos on music business advice, and every Friday, I do quick reviews of indie music. So you definitely want to get in on that. Now, let's talk about promoting your music on social media. The main social medias I'm going to be talking about are Instagram and TikTok. Now, you can promote the hell out of your album using these two sources primarily. But you have to post a lot. Now, they say once you post something like, say, your song, it takes five to ten interactions with someone before it sticks in their head and that they actually the song actually kind of grows on them. And you got to remember, too, some people might not even click the link to listen to your song. It just all depends. So let's say you have a thousand followers on Instagram and you have maybe a thousand or two on TikTok. That's great. But not everyone is going to see your promotion. You got to figure maybe 10 to 20 percent at the most. So you really got to put something out that's going to engage people. So they interact with your post more, such as commenting and liking. And this will get you in the algorithm so you can you know, your next post might go even further. It'll be shown to more people. More people that have the same interest as what you're trying to put out. Now, I said you have to post a lot about what you're trying to promote. But that doesn't mean spammy posts. Like, I'm not saying, oh, just put a link out saying, listen to my new song now. No, that's not going to work. Think of it this way. You need something fun, compelling, to get people to want to participate or to get people to want to talk about this and that. So what you got to do is you got to come up with something that will have people interact with you and your song so it'll stick with them. So think of a subject. Like what is your song about? What subject are you trying to put out there by creating the song? Is it a fun song? Is it a love song? Is it a breakup song? For instance, let's say you wrote a song about breaking up and heartbreak. You could start a series on TikTok and Instagram where whenever you put out a video, you could ask a question. Such as, what's the worst date you've ever been on? Or what's the worst breakup that you'll never forget? And while you do that, you put your song in the background. This works especially well for TikTok and Instagram because they have reels now. But TikTok, you just put your song in the background, go on the camera, and say, what has been your worst experience with breaking up with someone? Let me know. Leave it in the comments. And while you're doing that, your song is in the background. And people have the chance to listen to it right there. And if they like it, they'll click on it. So you got to put out a series of stuff like this. And you want to post at least twice a day. At least. And it can't be spammy. Not just a link. You have to have compelling stuff. Then the next day, what is the happiest breakup you ever went through? Or or uh, anything along the lines of what your song is about. It doesn't have to be a love thing. Obviously, there's tons of different subjects people put out. Look at what Lil Nas X did for his latest song, Industry Baby, and his album that he just put out. He did a whole thing on TikTok and Instagram where he was pregnant. And it sounds ridiculous and crazy to some, but it worked. It got people's attention. It got people to talk about him. And it was put on everyone's For You page on TikTok. And everyone got involved. He always played a sample of the song in the background. And it worked. That song went viral. And the album did very well. Has been doing very well. So it's things like this that are going to help put your music out there. Get the fans involved. Get them talking and commenting and liking and sharing. That's what you need to do. Now, I hope you liked this quick video. If you did, give it that thumbs up. Also, don't forget, go down below in the description. There are tons of things that can help your music career. There are ebooks that you can download. There's discounts on services such as Bandzoogle, TuneCore, DistroKid. You got to use them links though to get the discount when you use them. So be sure to take advantage of all that stuff. There's tons of other things down there that can help you out. So be sure to check it out. Now, I really appreciate you watching and I shall see you next video.